Good morning. <laughs> this is Miss Dia D. Special Things. I do have a few um, hauls to show you, and I got these over the last week, so I'm gonna have to remember what I got and what I'm showing you. I, I think I will do the um, the my Tuesday morning haul first uh, because it wasn't a lot of stuff. I went to Tuesday morning earlier in the week and they didn't have a lot of stuff that I didn't have already so that's all that I picked up I got this and I might have it already um, this basic gray mint julep washi tape and then they also had let's see I didn't get this that, that I already had I think I already had that yeah, I got some of these veneers. Um, they were 99 cent basic gray. Persimmon. And this right here, it was 59 cent. Just a smile. And let's see. Hold on here because I got another a set of these because I wanted this dark brown. And these two were $3.99. So that was almost like $2 a piece. And then I did pick up some of their liquid pearls, and these were 99 cent a piece, and these were the only two colors that they had. This is um, pearl bisque, and this is pearl lavender. Yeah, so those are the only two that I got. The other ones are stickles, distressed stickles. They were also 99 cent, and these were the only colors I got one of each of the colors that they had so yeah I'm not going to call you the colors because they may not even have those colors in your store you guess you have to go and see which colors that they had uh, something that I did get that I didn't have before was this uh, the berry the holly jolly and I may have shown you this so I might have gotten it even before that the holly jolly punch that means I need to put this stuff up right and then I got this, um, a piercer, yeah, a jewelry piercer. I guess I thought I needed it. I'm not even certain. But anyway, I found something that I thought was exciting was the pattern brayer set. And these are the shorter ones. And the thing about it is I have some brayers that I was looking for the handles for. I got them in this size and I got them in this size so now I don't have to look for those handles because I got the handle now I got to make sure it works but it was just the broyer handles and I got both of these sizes, so now I don't have to look for those handles but this one was the larger one was $8.99 and the smaller one was $6.99 but this is good for art journaling so yay I'm happy about that and then I did get some of their little embellied pieces. Here's some more. Some I wanted to do some Christmas uh, AT blocks. Yes, yeah, so I picked up those. And then they had some, and I know I have lots of these, but I wanted the letters. The Basic Gray Hey Boy collection. The letters, and they were 99 cent a piece. And Hey You collection. And the Hey Girl collection. And I just wanted these labels to put on stuff. I thought they were cute. And then just the Ephemera. Um, and it was not... All of these were 99 cents. This one was cute. It was 99 cents. Then I got the notes, the journal notes. It was 99 cents. And I got one of these. And I think I got this before. But I ended up getting two of these again. So I could always put it in a swab or a rack or something. But this uh, stamp was $1.99. Okay, so I think that's all that I got from Tuesday morning. And I got this Monday, so I'm certain your stores probably have it now. Now, another thing that I did was I ordered from Hobby Lobby. This is my actually my very first order from Hobby Lobby. And it's because there were some paper mache houses. Houses, yeah, that I just had to have. So I went ahead and I ordered those. But first I wanted to show you a paper stack. And I love Paper Studio paper. And it was a paper stack that I loved. Their paper was on sale. I ordered this last week. So their paper stacks were on sale 50% off. So I got the 
um, four and a half by six and a half inch sheet. And this was half price. I like the paper. I thought this paper was so pretty. So I got that. And I got the 12 by 12 stack. And it looks exactly like that's the other stack. But I thought the paper was so pretty. So now that I know I could order from um, Hobby Lobby without a whole bunch of issues, I think I'll do that. But this is what I went, I mean, I, why I ordered. And this is the first time I ordered this. And the thing that was nice about this was the fact that I was able to get the whole set. This is what I want. Can you see that? It's that paper mache house. And the whole set is a set of three. It was $14.97. And it was regular price sale. So I was able to use my 50% off coupon. And here's this is the larger one. And then nestled inside of here. Include the big one. Was this one? <laughs> there you are. And then nestled inside of it was an even smaller one. And I was able to get it for $8.97, the entire three piece set. And how cute is that? And they have prices on each of them. This one, the little set, was $3.99, so that's $4. And then on this one, it says it was $4.99, so that's $5. That's $9 already. So it's like I got these two for the price of this one. And then this one was $5.99 for the large one. And so that was like $16. So to get it for half the price, all three of them, that was a steal. But anyway, yeah, so... Um, yeah, so I probably should have gotten it all for, yeah, because they weren't on sale. But if I went to the store, I would have got it cheaper, but that's okay. And Marilyn G had showed some Faber Castell pencils that she got, uh, and I had a few of them. I think they only came, no, these came like six in a stack. Here's another one, I have them up here, and I use these a lot because I like this series. But I only had like six of them. Yeah. So when I saw hers, I said, hmm, do I need those? Because I have a lot of different sets of watercolor pencils. So the more I looked at her and then I watched her paint her little stamp image, I said, okay, let me at least look around and see if I could find some that are reasonably priced because she got uh, the entire set well i ordered it from amazon.com not the in well it's an entire set but it was a smaller set this right here and i got it's a 60 piece set and they come in a tin like this and the colors are in series like this is the blue and the reds and the yellows and the greens and the I guess uh, I don't know what colors but there's an array of colors and these are the neutrals so yeah I went ahead and got that so I'm going to give these a try and see I know they'll make a difference because I love these I love these and then I have all my paper because I use the watercolor cold press paper anyway and another thing that I saw on YouTube, Bona did this. Bona? Yeah, I think Bona did this. And she used this book. So I ordered the book from Amazon.com. And I my, my ink on my printer is low. So I'm actually going to take this page to the store with me. I'm going to take the whole book because I, I put... I outlined that right there that I have the right to copy this so I'm going to take this uh, to Staples and get these copied and even shrunk down so that I could make um, let's see these the, the book wasn't expensive yeah I want to make these 
just like she did. She did the dolls with the doilies. They are so cute. So yeah, I'm going to take those this morning. I think, uh, if I remember, I'm going to take these to the store and have them um, printed so that I could make um, some of the uh, yeah, some of those banners. Yeah, I think they're so cute. But I also got some happy mail this I mean this week and it was from a girlfriend of mine. She went back to Daiso. Um, whenever she's looking for something for me, if she can't find it or get enough, she'll send it to me later. But she sent me some more of these little doodads. But she sent me the little ribbons. Yeah, she found the little bows again. So she sent me some more bows. So thank you, Alvinia. Really appreciate it. I love these little bows. And for what I'm doing with the AT blocks and the ATCs, the dimensional ATCs, I'm doing like Tilda style stuff. So these little bows are really coming in handy. The ones that I got from Paper Mart, they're not that teeny. I wanted them this teeny. They're not as teeny. I think one of the sets that I got was probably this teeny, but they're not that teeny, whereas I can use them on my little jars and stuff. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, so this weekend I am actually going to have a lot of fun. I do not, I do not plan to, uh, go shopping but if by chance you know sometimes I'll sit here and I'll do crafts and then I'll get bored and I'll say okay let me go to the store and see what they have I'm gonna try not to do that this weekend I'm I really have a lot of projects to finish up a lot of projects to do so that's what I'm going to try to do and see if I could uh, get most of my swaps out the way so I could start doing my gift stuff yeah but anyway uh, thanks for watching everyone and I'll talk to you later Bye-bye. Have a nice, happy, crafty weekend. Bye-bye.